Once you get accepted by Rev, you can find the style guide under Resources, Style Guide. This guide explains customer expectations for captioning quality and the metrics system, which is our way of ensuring freelancer quality. It's also in PDF format, so it's really easy to download and print out if you prefer a physical copy to scribble some notes on. The Help Center is an extension of the style guide that expands upon Rev's guidelines in much more detail. These could be clarifications for unique situations you encounter or customer specific instructions that you have to follow. You can find it under Help, Help Center. You can also use a search function to find resources to assist you. To view your metrics, go to My Work, Metrics. Metrics show your account standings in five main categories. Accuracy, which refers to just exactly that, accurately capturing what words are said and who says them, as well as punctuation and spelling. Formatting, which is things like speaker labels, atmospherics, and logical caption breaking. Alignment, which refers to correctly syncing the start of the caption groups to when the sound or dialogue is heard. On time percentage, which is the percentage of jobs you've turned in on time versus turned in late and commitment ratio, which is the number of jobs you submitted divided by the number of jobs you've unclaimed beyond the unclaimed window, which we'll talk about shortly. Accuracy, formatting, and alignment have major and minor errors, which are the most common reasons customers return files to be redone. For a more detailed index of common errors, check out slide five of the style guide. As you navigate the fine work page, nicknamed the queue by Revers, you can preview a job as long as you want before claiming it to get a feel for what it's about. When you claim a file that is two minutes in length or longer, you have 60 minutes to preview it even more carefully, meaning you can unclaim the file within that 60 minutes without affecting your commitment ratio. Files less than two minutes in length have an unclaimed window of 50 minutes. Be sure to check the beginning, middle, and end to see if it's the right fit for you. Maybe the audio becomes challenging, or there's graphic content you're not comfortable seeing or listening to, or maybe life gets in the way and you can't work on the file any longer. If you're stuck in a file and need advice, you can use Ask an Expert. Experts are revers that Rev has handpicked to answer questions you may have about your file. To get help, go to Project, Project Details. From there, go to Help, Ask Our Experts. Fill out the form details and you'll be connected to a Rev expert in a live chat. The Rev Forum is where you can connect to other Revers across the world and Rev staff to find endless resources and answers to questions you may have. Our forum has discussion categories for all of Rev's services and announcements, customer information, social if you don't feel like talking about work, and more. Oh yeah, by the way, introduce yourself on the forum and Revers will be happy to help guide you through your first steps and get to know you. Text expanders allow you to assign shortcuts to words and phrases you type often. When you type an expander and hit the spacebar or type any punctuation marks, it will expand to the phrase you defined. To add an expander, type the shortcut you'd like the word to have and type the full word in the second text field. Click add and you're all set. If you have a specific topic you're working on and only want to use expanders for that particular job, check the box for use in this job only. After you submit your file, the checked ones will be deleted. To edit an expander, simply click the expander or word. To delete one, click the X. If you'd like to tinker around with the editor to learn the interface, learn shortcuts, or manage your text expanders without claiming a real customer job, you can go to Resources, Explore Dash. If you'd like to do the captioning tutorial again just to learn some more, you can go to Resources, Caption Tutorial. Use the links on the left side to navigate back through it. With that, that's eight things you should know as a rookie starting out with Rev. Now I know it sounds like a ton of information and it's probably a little overwhelming, but accuracy is always much more important than speed, so taking it slowly is the best way to learn and gain confidence in captioning. 
If you get a bad grade, no worries, it happens to the best of us. And mistakes are going to happen, especially in the beginning. Be sure to read your grader comments to see where you can improve and go for it.